Oh, what just happened? Did I just die already? Oh, they look. I can't believe you came back for us. You saved our lives. Lieutenant, you took a direct hit. How do you feel? I feel like shit. That wound looks bad. I don't think the lieutenant can talk. Copy that. Lieutenant, what you just did was both the bravest and dumbest thing I have ever seen. I kept count. You took out 11 of Rommel's best men. <laughs> 11? I can grab a strap? Ugh. Now what? Grab the pistol and shoot. Oh. Wow. Wow. Make that 12. Ooh. Lieutenant, please try not to move. Sarge! Right, no! Don't worry. We're gonna get you out of here. Dog looked like Hitler from down here. We're gonna save you. If I don't want to say good morning, Lieutenant. Oh, I'm Colonel Ebbets. Hey. Welcome back to the land of the living. You've been through a lot, so I'll keep it brief. I'm with the Office of Strategic Services. Our mission is sabotage, subversion, and everything in between. We're taking the fight to the Nazis, going after the Third Reich and their this home is. turf. We do some of the most dangerous work of the war, and we're looking for people just like you. Now, the sergeant and I go way back. He's an excellent judge of character. And for what you did in Tunisia, he's nominated you for the Medal of Honor. Trust me, Lieutenant. I hate doing paperwork. But in your case, I made an exception. You saved our lives. I have a motto. Life is usually a pageant of idiots and fools. But occasionally, you find yourself in the company of good people. And then, anything is possible. Lieutenant, you are now going to hear the most important question I can ask. Would you like to join the OSS? Give us thumbs up. <laughs> I can really give him an option. Y'all sure this nigga is not Hitler? He look like Hitler with no mustache. Yeah, Excellent. I mean, bro. What about you, gentlemen? That's simple. We go where the lieutenant goes. Yes, sir. I have every confidence you're going to make me look like a genius for re ha! recruiting you. Hey. Welcome Ready? to the OSS. Just give me my props. Oh, just looking at me, bro. Like, they up to something. What the fuck? Hey, Quack. nigga, it's a whole... Why you got this strap right here, bro? Hello, Lieutenant. I'm Hello. Dr. Thatch. Welcome to the infirmary. Ah, we'll have you back on your feet in no time. Ah, I know you're having some trouble speaking after what happened in Tunisia, so let's just use hand gestures, eh? Could have skipped in the beginning, but I wanted to, you know. Daily OC, no? Bro, what the fuck did, what did you just say? Welcome to the fire oh. range, Lieutenant. Now that you're back on your feet, the Colonel thought we should give you a quick combat refresher. Your current objective is always shown on your oh. sleeve. Take a look. What? what? Look at the right. Oh. Cover your hand cool. over objects. Press the grip button to grip. You can use either hand. Give your other hand a try. I need some wine, though. Now it's time to move, Lieutenant. I see you're right-handed, just like me. Good. Makes this training easy. Look at your sleeve again. The arrow always points in the direction you need to go. Use the left stick to move, the right stick to turn. Not tripping. What they playing? They playing basketball or something? Press in the left stick. Three, four, one, two, front piece. I got limited stamina. Right, Lieutenant, it's time to shoot stuff. Oh, Specialist yeah. McKinney is here. I ain't trying to hear you. Grab the pistol though. from its holster on your hip. Squeeze the trigger to fire. Pistol with both hands will give you more stability and accuracy. Oh. Oh, Press this button to eject the mag. Excellent job, Lieutenant. Now, grab a fresh magazine from your other hip. Bring the magazine up to the glowing indicator and then let go. Look at that. Like magic. Squeak now. Let go of the pistol. 
pistol. A weapon will automatically return to its holster after you release it. Larger weapons will holster on your back. Reach over your shoulder and grab your M1A1 submachine gun. Automatically oh. holster it over your shoulder. Now reach over your other shoulder and grab the M1 Garand rifle. Damn, I got three weapons, man. Remember, fill it with both hands for more stuff. This is why I love the M1 Garand, Lieutenant. Its ammunition clip ejects automatically after the last bullet. So press this. Ah, listen to that ping. But remember, just drop it in. No need to charge the Garand. It's ready to go. Weapon. Let go of the Garand and it will automatically return to its slot. You're doing great, Lieutenant. Let's hey. move down to the next station. Yes, yeah, sir. What are you looking at, nigga? Come on! Mm. <clears throat> Story in. It's Ollie, right? Yes, sir. Ollie, how old are you? I'm 23. 23? I'm 19. Oh. Damn, he lied. I'm 16. Damn! I have every right to be here. More than you, that's for sure. What? The Nazis didn't bomb Abilene, Texas. They bombed London, England. They destroyed burned my entire life to the ground and now I want to do the same thing to the Third Reich. Yeah. Go ahead, turn me in. I'll find a way to get to the front. How do you think I got to Tunisia? Forging transfer orders has become an hobby of mine. I will make it to France. Ah, don't worry, Ali. Your secret's safe. I'm pretty sure the lieutenant isn't going to say anything. Thank you, Sarge. Thank you, Lieutenant. But I have two rules. Keep your head down and do exactly what I say. Yes, sir. You don't listen to me even once. I'll turn you over to the Germans myself, understand? I understand, sir. I won't disappoint you. Either of you. Are we like captives right now, or are we going to the Somehow, base? Somehow, this motley crew has been tasked with saving civilization. God help us all. Damn yeah, right. Yep. All right. Enough talking, training, and tests. It's time to go after the Nazis. We're sending you into occupied France. Yes, sir. Your first mission is to make contact with the French resistance. You'll be working with a cell led by Manon Batiste, who's been our eyes and ears on the ground since the war started. Your rendezvous will be along the coast at the St. Catherine Lighthouse. Germans are using as an observation post. The resistance will give you a signal when it's safe to come ashore. You'll have three days to assist the resistance, gather intelligence on German activity, and sabotage targets of opportunity. Now I'm talking about Ew. a small communications relay or a fuel truck, not anything like blowing up a train. What's he staring at me for, Nick? This is your first OSS Look, mission. Really can get the hands beat, Nick. Now I want to introduce you to Huxley, the quartermaster. She's been staring Don't at me the whole time, Chief. Need. Unless she'll give you some nice goodie bags for the resistance. I don't Three like that. Three days in and out. Keep it simple. I'll see you on the other side. Just missed. Right. You staring at me? Hello, I'm What's Huxley, up? your quartermaster. Right. I'm here to brief you on weapons, gear, and all the threats you'll face. I'm backed up by a full model shop, a sewing brigade, and the best gunsmiths the Allied nations have to offer. Have a look around. I'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Okay. Okay. I'm ah, to... your trusty sidearm, the semi-automatic 1911 A1 pistol, reliable and accurate. It's quite useful at mid to long ranges with both hands, and mid to short ranges with one hand. This special weapon is on loan from Colonel Ebbets. Apparently, it's a family heirloom. He calls it Uncle Nate's Rough Rider. I call it an exquisite Nazi killing machine. It can be fired entirely one-handed, 
with only minimal impact to accuracy. And it's the only rifle in your arsenal oh. that can be reloaded entirely one-handed. Oh, that's While lit. slightly less lethal than a bolt-action rifle, it's deadlier than any semi-automatic. Any hood up is best Bye. for mid to long range combat. And it can be slam fired yeah, by holding it two handed while keeping the trigger squeezed. Ah. Just remember to cock the lever after every shot. This is lit. I'm about to hit a clip. Watch this. What? <laughs> On my candy, bro. Oh, we on the motherfucking boat, Nick. You diving in? You diving in? Keep an eye on the lighthouse. We're supposed to look for a signal. That's that's a big ass signal. It works for me. Okay. That explosion got the attention of all the German patrols in the area. This place is about to be crawling with Nazis. Lieutenant, we need you to eliminate all incoming enemies while Ali and I help Mano with the supplies. Load up on ammunition and first aid. The Germans will be there any second. Lieutenant, looks like enemy reinforcements are heading up the road. Chunks it. I'm dirt, I'm dirt, sorry. Uh, uh, what was that? Stem out of my body. I'm stuck in my shit. Mink, mink, you feel me? Got that. Let's see if not say. Hang, 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 hang! It was already supposed to happen. This is our base of operations, the village of De Bisson. Most people here are good, but we must operate in the shadows. You never know where the Gestapo has eyes. How bad have things gotten? 
The German occupation has turned every neighbor into a possible enemy. That's terrible. I will do anything to get the Nazis out of my country. Anything? The Third Reich is ruthless. You know what I'm talking about. But so is the French Resistance. I grew up here. My old school teacher still lives in that house. My grandpère was the village tailor. My parents owned the bicycle shop. I'm trying to whip this bitch. That's the boucherie. At least that Bruce Where Lee. my brother worked. And here we are. Our secret base. It don't look secret. It's a lib it's a library. What's up, gang? Fuck you staring at bit. Sorry. Welcome to my bookstore. Marcel has a special workshop upstairs. For things you know. That the we have a serious problem. Something big is happening inside Gestapo headquarters, and we don't know what it is. Against my wishes, Julia slips inside undercover as a threat. She's seen a dramatic increase in radio transmissions and coded messages. What's it all about? They have something, I don't know what, locked away on the second floor. I can't get near it. They've even brought in the Waffen SS. We need to find out. But our usual source of information has suddenly gone quiet. He knows what's going on. Is he a high-ranking German? Worse. He's French. A collaborator. Yeah. <laughs> His name is Louis Metz. He used to be mayor of this town. But he has now betrayed everything and everyone. But if he's a Nazi collaborator, why does he help you? Because we have photographs. Whatever propels Louis to betray his nation also propels him to drink. And um, other excesses. This Fuck man is the Why do you garment. look at me and say that? Have no doubt he will do anything to save his own skin. But something has him spooked badly that enough be? that he broke off contact with us two weeks Why ago. Why are you hiding it? And we're going to go after him. So we're gonna kill him? No. Kidnap. Okay. That supposed to shock me or something? This ain't the first time I kidnapped somebody. <laughs> Not kids or nothing, you know. Lock his ass up! Lock his ass up! <laughs> you going to jail? Lieutenant, this is a perfect spot for our ambush, but we need you to clear out the checkpoint first. Can I sneak up on him? That'd be so rough. I can't. I can't. My eyes Why deceive me? Like, relax. The fuck you doing here, nigga? Oh, shit. Commando, hold up. Damn, I, I got blammed. Are you serious? I thought. Lieutenant, right. this My is bad. a perfect spot yeah, for yeah, our ambush, it. but we need you to clear out the checkpoint first. Right. I'm gonna pull this out of here. Hey, say less. Headshot. Shoot him too. Yeah. Damn, who the fuck shoot? Bitch! Bitch! I got my strap. I got the. I got the. Y'all don't know who y'all missing. Is that a mine? The next day, the motherfucker was dead. I was. What was. What was going on in those pictures? The table. I'll explain it when you're older. Oh, I bro, I knew it. She just showed herself and like, woo. Be quick. Louis and his convoy will pass through here in a few minutes. He travels with an entourage of well-trained troops, so we need to be careful. What are you thinking? We set a trap. 
some dynamite along the road. Boom. Okay, okay, I see. Some spigot guns in strategic spots. And Skinny. our people positioned along the road. We have to be precise. Uh, so we need I. to neutralize everyone but Louis. No witnesses. Lieutenant. Yes. Let's put a plan together. Where do you want the dynamite? Um. Point at the table, top, and select a. I would say here. Here. Oh. Uh huh. Excellent choice. Boom. Because you got to think about it. You got to think about it. Now our people. Hear me out. You placed it right there, right? And they blow up. And they sink down, right? Because I feel like they're coming from... I don't know. But I think I had a people right here. I'm on it. Be careful. So can, or if they come down over there, he can come back. You feel me? You know, after they, Juliet? After they sink down. Now, if they're coming from here... Boom. Hillside, right? The sergeant? The sergeant? Sure. He could be like... He could be like right here. Say on the other side. And finally... Where do you want me? Right here? Nah, I'm just playing, I'm just playing. What do you mean by that? Nice. Bro. Good teamwork. You know, oh, they still coming. Wow. 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 Oh, that's my teammate. Oh. Look at that. The plan. Plan came in clutch. Clutch mode. Ah, good. The Americans are here. <laughs> Excuse me, careful with that. Thank you. Salut, espèce de con. Tonne merde. Hors du. Chant de collabo. Uh, English, please? Yes, I feel like we're missing some interesting discourse here. Why haven't you reported in? It's been two weeks. They know there is a spy. Be careful. You poor baby. What are the Nazis up to? Uh, winning the war? Fils de pute. I have zero patience right now, Louis. If you think that I'm treating you bad, imagine when we tell the Gestapo all about your nocturnal activities. Remember, I have pictures. <laughs> I don't like her, bro. There is a list. A list? Of all the resistance members in Normandy. The Gestapo's been compiling it for months. They are bringing in a trainload of special troops to round everyone up. When? I do not know. I am not privy to... Mm. Tonight! Five o'clock. Uh... Marcel. Oui, mademoiselle. We need to blow up a train. Allons-y. <laughs> Trying to get some of that Hennessy. That's all the brand. So how does one become a collaborator? What are the job qualifications? Weakness? Cowardice? Or just plain self-centered opportunism? <laughs> All of the above. Unfortunately for me, we still have a little business to take care of. I cannot go back to the Gestapo looking this way. I need to look like I bravely escaped. Hmm? I don't want to hurt my dreams of becoming a concert pianist. Lieutenant, oh. please do the honor. I'm about to knock your ass out, bitch. Knock him out, punch him in the shit. Punch him. <laughs> Come here so I can you know. I you know. Time to catch a train. Hold oh, on, let me punch his ass again. Stomach. Yeah, no, I'll fuck his stomach. I'm about to break his face. Alright. 
Everything ready? Of course, mademoiselle. Okay, let's fall back. No, no, we're safe here. I'm pretty confident in my measurements. Are you crazy? Oh, too late. God help us. Die, and then head almost fell off my shoulder. I told you. <sighs> but yeah. Wow, wow. Wow, hold that. Ready? Where they at? Where they at? Where they at? Call out. I need call outs, man. This nigga up close. I'm about to run up on him. That. Y'all know who y'all. Yes, sir. I didn't put up. Oh, this is rough. I ain't gonna lie. I wasn't expecting I could do this. Close one, son. That's cool. Come on, man. Yes, sir. Gotta get the hell out of here. Really touch this week. Let's move out. Yeah. Nice work, Marcel. Merci beaucoup. Not sure. This gentleman appears to be the highest ranking German on the train. Not good. This is one of Rudolf Miller's men. Uh oh. Miller is the director of special projects for the German High Command. He's involved. He's not good for anything. Can't even take my helmet off. He's not for anything. What's it say? Hell, lots of words in German. Operation Annihilation. The troops on this train were being sent to Dubuisson to round up some resistance members all over Normandy. And not just suspected members. Every person in their family, too. Yeah. What about the list? Of extreme secrecy, there's only one copy being kept in a safe on the second floor of Gestapo headquarters. It says that the list has over 400 names on it. <sighs> well, shit. They're just going to keep sending trains. We need to get that list. But it's impossible to sneak in. The second floor is guarded around the clock. I have an idea. Mano, a frontal assault on Gestapo headquarters is a much different proposition than ambushing a convoy or blowing up a train. We can't do it alone. C'est vrai. It's true. We need more resistance members, but that's much easier said than done. <gasps> I know who we could get. No, no, oui. no, no, oui, no, oui, no, oui, no, oui, no, oui. no, no. They're crazy. Oh, Marcel. I'm afraid I agree with your sister. They're idiots. Who are we talking about? <sighs> the Vino brothers. The Vino brothers. What the hell is a Vino brother? Bro. Crazy. I could have just up the pole, up the pole. Blah, blah, blah. He, 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 he.